Hey, all you Freddies out there, welcome back to another Brawl Stars video. Um, today, we're going over a Club League match that it's not really too big of a deal, but I really liked the synergy between me and my brother, especially uh, since we didn't have our typical third partner, PS, to play with us. Um, so to kind of give you guys an idea of how the draft went, and I know I'm giving away the ending with the victory right there. Uh, we had first pick Tick, and I don't know why our teammate picked Tick, but he did, or she did, whatever. And the other team had picks two and three, which I'm pretty sure they picked Poco and Frank. Um, so even though they're lesser levels than us, um, that I feel like that's a really good counter to Tick for sure. Uh, with all that HP and Tick barely does any damage against those uh tanks and semi tanks um so i had fourth pick and my brother had fifth pick uh, so i knew we needed something with a lot of damage um and i don't usually play b but i've been trying to practice b uh lately um since i usually play like the sharpshooter on the team which is like bell and byron and others like that so i feel like b would be a natural transition for me um granted there's a lot of choke points on this map uh, but i felt between the tick and frank wall breaks eventually the the map would open up well enough to benefit b uh, so between the potential for a lot of damage and the potential for the map opening quite a bit um that's why i picked b as opposed to brawlers that i typically play like lola or bow for example um, and then my brother also knowing that we needed something with a lot of damage picked Daryl um, Which I felt he also probably picked because of the role and to interrupt Frank's super uh, So I think that was a good pick on his part And then the other team Rounded out their sixth pick with the crow um, So yeah, let's just go ahead and jump into the first game Alright, so uh, our, the tick on our team decided to uh, go AFK for the first couple of seconds. So it's just me and my brother. Um, I'm trying to take it slow, not go too crazy because we don't have the third player. I'm just trying to whittle down what I can. Tick went down really fast, so I'm not forcing it. I'm just doing what I can, backing up, don't feed. I slow down the Poco, my brother seeds it, goes in, so it's a good read by him, ignores the crow. And then we both go for the Frank. Like this whole, both these matches, we were on the same page of who to go for. That probably wasn't the best gadget by me, but I wanted to see what Poco had. Was it Decapo, Screeching Solo? If I forced out to use a super against my Honey Pot, at least he wasn't healing his teammates. Uh, so I, was, I think it was a decent gadget by me. Um, Let's see, my brother goes down, I'm using Tick as a meat shield because I don't want to get poisoned and Tick I feel is worthless, so uh, not to brag, but I'm definitely more valuable than Tick, so let him take the damage. My brother sees that I slow the Poco, he goes for Poco, and then immediately after we take him out, he goes for the Frank, so really good read by my brother. We're definitely on the same page, um, going after the same targets, taking them out as fast as possible. Uh, kind of like Overwatch, if you take out the supports, the tanks can't sustain and they go out. So I think without communicating it, because we were not using comms on the, these matches, um, we both kind of subconsciously knew what to go for based on our Overwatch experience, especially my brother has a lot of it. And then like the three plus years that me and my brother have been playing together on Brawl Stars. So um, that's why I really enjoyed this match because even with the odds against us, um, or I felt like the odds were against us, we uh, worked really well as a duo. So that's the first match. So let's go ahead and go into the second match. Ignore all those other matches. It's just me playing ladder with my sister. <laughs> Alright, 
the second match. I know I already spoiled the ending, but I'm not going to edit out the victory, so that's okay. Um, Tick decided to spawn this time with us, and since he went mid, I went ahead and went lane, because don't want to give Poco and Frank value and stack up. Um, uh, Alright, so 2v1, I'm just trying to stall however I can until I get back up. We instinctively both go for Poco, take out the heals, and then we go for the rest of the team. My brother's getting really good trades, uh, two for one trades, and then uh, I'm doing enough damage to whittle them all down. My brother finished them off. And I get a lot of value out of this honeypot, or this gadget, because they get it really low, but they end up not being able to take it out for some reason. At this point, it's pretty much over, and look, <laughs> the Poco Rage quits, he decides to just stay at spawn. Um, but yeah, me and my brother played really well together, I really enjoyed our... the way we both attack the same targets, and like, on the same page almost every time. And with the dumb tick pick, so... Anyways, yeah, just wanted to record those two matches, because uh, I thought they were fun, and hope you all enjoyed.